Blessings, everybody. Blessings. You know, it's Dominic Angus here. Because it's not my ADK channel. You see your grandchild at a spiritual war. See him with thanking the Lord thy God. And God put him out to read a Bible verse to share it with everybody. It's from, it's, from, it's from New Testament. I think it's Galatians 6. I think it's from verse... Um, per verse... Um, Galatians 6, right? It's a chapter 6, verse 7 to verse 9. I'm going to read it now. He said, Be not deceived, God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. For he that soweth to his flesh shall reap of shall reap of the flesh. Shall reap of the flesh reap corruption. But he that soweth to the spirit shall of the spirit reap life everlasting. And let us not be weary in well doing. But in due season, we shall reap if we faint not. So practically, we're not supposed to sow in the flesh. That's we're going to reap destruction and corruption. So we can't walk in the flesh anymore. I try my best every day to walk in the spirit. Because if we walk in the spirit right now, we're going to reap everlasting life. Guys, if the rapture is coming one day, and God's going to rapture his church, I don't want to be left behind. I love my dog breeding. I love a lot of people. I know some people... That I have to push away because they, they show me negative energy. I still love them. At the end of the day, I just like that God is trying to save his people. Because really and truly, I was the someone who used to party, used to be in the world. Used to like the earthly music. Now I'm listening to gospel. I have a couple of heart shaking gospel. I have a couple of spiritual gospel. And I have I just a couple of few rap gospel from Marcus Rogers. But I don't listen to the worldly music anymore. I don't party anymore. Be my soul, your life boring, you can't get to enjoy yourself. That is just sin, it's not really enjoyment. But Christ is calling his church every day. I'm in his spiritual attack, and I realize the spiritual attack is real. And I thank God for the few dogs I have. I lose a lot of dogs the other day, quality puppies that could make me be a top kennel in the bully breed in Jamaica. But they sadly pass off. But I'm starting with some new ones, hoping for the best. All I can say, buddy, please know that no matter what you're going through, I'm going through a lot financially and everything. Serve God. Jesus Christ is calling, and Jesus Christ is definitely here for us. So bless my body. Do the right thing. And remember, Christ loves you. Blessings.